Welcome to a video about things people have made for my Whip It. Hey, hello darling, good girl. So for those of you who don't know, Jess has got an Instagram and a TikTok account. I'll put the details somewhere. But my favourite thing about her account is that she's got lots of wonderful followers who are incredibly generous and I absolutely love it when they make things for her. So some of these are things that people have written to me and asked if they can make for her. Some of them are things that I've asked people to make for her. Okay, this bow tie made by Frankie's Boutique. So I paid for this one. They have an option to put whatever you want on the inside of your bow tie. So I went for a design with boobs. We love boobs, don't we? We love boobs. That says, all bodies are good bodies. Um, she's got a tiny little neck, so I've had to put a little bow in the back. But are you ready? Good girl. You look lovely, my darling. Okay, next is this really cute snood that was made by our friend Josie, who I'll put her account here, Tui the Whippet, who you might already know and love. Um, anyway, it's a really nice pink colour, and this, is it on? There it is with your little ears out. For those of you who don't know, whippets are, they've got not very much body fat and they've only got one layer of fur where most breeds of dog have two. So they get very chilly and that means that's why you sometimes, well you often see them in coats, you should always see them in coats in the winter. But a snood is helpful too, to keep their long thin neck warm and we find it helpful during fireworks as well if you put it over her ears. It's a bit less stressful for you isn't it? A bit less stressful. Good girl, you're doing really well. Whoop. Okay, this one might be my favorite. Look at this. It's a little crochet. You like this one? You should put it on. It's a little crochet bonnet. And it was designed and made for Jess by um, Olivia, wasn't it? Okay, okay. <laughs> by Olivia from Crochet and Stitch. She's 13 and she designed this herself. I think it's like, it looks like a little strawberry. It's adorable. It's got ear holes. Are you ready? Are you going to put it on? Okay, here we go. Oh, sorry. Yes, thank you. Oh, I know. I know. There you go. Oh, sweet girl. Okay, ready? <laughs> This one is definitely my favourite. Actually, this is was designed and made for her by Solly at Hope Dog. The inspiration for it was that Beyonce hold up video where she wears the amazing yellow dress and carries the bat. But Solly designed and knitted all of this herself and it's extraordinary detail. Like, look at this. It's beautiful. Really beautiful. Um, this is the back and the neck. And then Jess's little legs go through these leg holes here. And it's got a little turtleneck. We love a turtleneck. Are you ready? Hey? You wanna pop it on? She's not sure. You wanna pop it on? Oh, good girl. Well done, okay. I know, I know. What a beautiful dog. You're gorgeous. So this is the detailing on the front. And then this is the back. It's almost like a butterfly. I just think it's, I just think it's gorgeous. Anyway, people love seeing her in this. I love seeing you in this, my darling. It's very autumnal. It's very sweet. And it's also really warm, which from a practical standpoint is great. And it doesn't have 
back legs like she does wear stuff with back legs and we like stuff with back legs but um, not always sometimes it's better to have something that's a bit easier to get on um, so this is great for that and it keeps her neck really warm okay next this is a bit of a cheat these pajamas it's a bit of a cheat because I made these for her but people really enjoy them they're very silly um, and you're about to see how appallingly bad at sewing I am so <laughs> First of all, here you go. This is them. Um, very Elton John, I like to think. Hey, Elton John? Yes. Yeah, but this, I think, was the second or third thing I made, and I'll just show you some, <laughs> some of the details. So these are the sleeves. Very cute, very cute. But like, look, I mean, everything's just got gaping holes in it. This is the neck. That's a huge hole. <laughs> Oh, and it goes all the way through. But I had so much fun making this. I was really struggling in the second lockdown at the end of 2020, or I think it was the beginning of 2021. Anyway, and I saw that um, Honey the Iggy's mum was making her lots of clothes, gorgeous clothes. So I downloaded this pattern from Etsy, it's called Whip It Jazz, and I made loads of these suits. And it was really fun. And I kind of suck at sewing, but I was teaching myself as I went along. And I think we did all right. And we got through. Anyway, so I'll show you what it looks like on. And then can we put your feet in? Normally we dress her standing up. Oh, belly rubs. Normally we dress her standing up and it's much easier, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so we've got, we've got the front legs in. Oh. Hey. Front paws in, but back paws very much not in yet, are they? You don't seem super keen. It's very comfy on the bed. I don't think she wants to stand up. Do ya? I felt like we might have just filmed a really, really short video. Um, my accomplice has disappeared. She's down here. What are you doing? Good girl. We're still learning to YouTube. You've done really well. She's done spectacularly well. So I reckon we'll probably try this again. Maybe we'll post it, maybe we won't, but either way, I suspect there'll be a better version and a longer version because there were a couple of other bits that I wanted to show you as well. Anyway, she has been my stunning volunteer, Jess the dog. I've been Jess the human. Check us out on our social media channels. Uh, peace out. <laughs>